The show is getting ready to start. Take your seat. The Milan Fashion Week that wrapped over the weekend asked more from designers than ever before with more than 40 showcases being shifted to online rather than in person. Designers from around the globe had to dig deep in terms of their creativity, from Moschino's puppet show runway to Todd's glamorized Zoom call. Different designers found new and exciting ways to show off their collection. In addition to this, the diversity and inclusivity of different models throughout the week gave us an insight into the exciting future of the fashion world. Many designers used not only different models in terms of size, but also in age. Milan Fashion Week exhibited how the fashion world has made a commitment to reflecting the diverse customer base that their clothing is sold to. Notable mentions. Moschino was one brand that really thought outside the box this year, creating a mock fashion show using only puppets. The Italian fashion house set the tone for this year's creativity with obscurity. Designed with the help of Jim Henson's Creature Shop, the creator of the Muppets, all looks from the collection were modeled to fit the assembly of puppets created for the runway. The collection used mainly pastel colors in a series of elegant dresses with big bows and exaggerated stitching. The soft pinks and blues are reminiscent of a princess playset a child might own. Moschino has captured the attention of our childhood fantasies. And even the audience of the mock fashion show included puppet versions of various celebrities, including the highly revered Vogue editor, Anna Winter Puppet herself, fitted with a puppet pair of her iconic black sunglasses and trademark bulb. Although about to be taken over by British designer Kim Jones, Fendi exhibited its last ever solo show for the designer Silvio Venturini. Naturally, Venturini wanted to do something big and symbolic, and thus the theme of the collection was Familia. Using monochrome fabrics and focusing on silhouettes, the Fendi collection championed the bodies of all different types of models. Ashley Graham, the famous plus-size model, returned to the runway for the first time since giving birth to a son, Isaac, in January, as well as Paloma Alessa, another plus-sized American model, who all looked terrific on the runway, walking for the second time for the year in Fendi. Yasmin Le Bon, 55, and Penelope Tree, 70, were also featured amongst the Fendi family models, in which Venturini showed off the way her clothes look not only terrific on all models, but that each piece has the ability to celebrate the wearer's particular body type, whatever their age. Mentored by the Milan-based African-American designer Edward Buchan, Claudia Giselle Nassama, brand Gisfab, emerged as Milan's Fashion Week's one to watch bringing black Italians to the forefront of the fashion industry. Her brand draws great inspiration from her two biggest Japanese fashion icons, Yunya Watanabe and Yoji Yamamoto. It seems with this collection that all their hard work has paid off and is now being met with great recognition from some of the biggest names in the industry. She said, inspired by contemporary art and Asian fashion, Gizfab's Spring Summer Collection has been championed by Michelle Nagormo, founder of Afro Fashion Week in Milan, for its ability to live, dream and create from not one but two cultures. Versace gave the audience an ability to escape this year into Atlantis. Taking on this incredible underwater theme, all models had slick back hair and dewy skin, as if they were Ariel the Mermaid, who had just learned to walk on land. Donatella Versace described her vision as a, a world made of popping colours and fantastic creatures setting the scene with ancient pillars and sculptures for the models to lie on. The vibrant colours and slick designs grabbed your attention. The collection emphasised once again how great Donatella Versace is at the age of 65 doing this incredible job in fashion. Despite the challenges that Italy has faced over the course of the year, the 2021 Milan Fashion Week proved that Italian designers have truly stepped up. Through their hard work and creativity, this past week's fashion shows 
raise the bar yet again for what an audience can expect when they walk into a 2021 and beyond fashion show.